Hi, I'm Rachel Vale, the author of Do Over, If We Kiss, You Maybe, and my new book, Lucky. And my message to you today is, get lucky. I was always interested in books about taboos. Um, books that have to do with subjects that you're not supposed to talk about. And now I find the big taboo is money. And it affects everybody, not just adults, but kids too. And kids, kids struggle with it, but you can't talk about it. I know when I was 14, my dad lost his, um, his business. His business went under. And I knew about it, but although I could talk to my best friend about my lack of curves or lack of boyfriend, I couldn't talk to her really about what was going on. It was family business, and I didn't know what was going to happen. I was a kid of enough imagination to come up with a lot of possible horrible scenarios, but it was scary to me. And I thought, that's something I'd like to write about. Um, so that's how I came up with the idea for the trilogy. In this book, Lucky, it's from the point of view of Phoebe, who's the youngest of three sisters. And everything is sort of easy, and she's a happy kid. She has four best friends. She's beautiful. Boys like her. She thinks she's lucky because nothing bad has ever happened to her. And so I put myself in that place. I, I come from an acting background, and so I get into character, and I work on the character, and how she sits, and how she walks, and what does she clench when she's nervous, and um, what's in her pockets, and what does she hate about herself, what would she change about herself if she could. Then the next book after this in the trilogy is called Gorgeous, and it's um, Phoebe's older sister, Allison. And in her place, she's the middle sister, and she takes life rough, and so to get into her head is a very different exercise. But I also don't just go inside, I go out. And I correspond with lots of teens. I get lots of emails and letters, which I love. And I love hearing from kids. And what they tell me rings very true to me. And I think in so many ways it hasn't changed. Being a teenager is the same as it ever was, at least for me. And I'm very much in touch with that part of myself. My first kiss was pretty lucky, um, although I wiped it off because my father was filming it. It was on stage in a play, and the, my boyfriend, Frank, um, kissed me at curtain call. Having a brother was very lucky. My brother always wanted me to tell him stories and make stuff up. I don't think I'd be a writer if it weren't for my little brother. Is ninth grade lucky for anybody? Unlucky. Oh, quite unfortunate. Very unlucky. Very lucky. Love to be the center of attention unless my top falls off like it did at one dance when I was with my friend Jill. On a hot day, so lucky. It can be so romantic to get caught in the rain with a boy you have a crush on. Any kind of cat, unlucky. Rachel Beth Vale, get down here now, you guess.